On the starting line, two drivers thinking about winning. Don Prudhomme, it's been a long time since 1982 in the winner's circle. For Johnny West, he has never tasted victory at an NHRA national event. A final check of the cars by starter Buster Couch. They're both stayed. It's a good start. Something going wrong for Johnny West. A flash of fire under the fiberglass body. And Don Prudhomme is the winner. An unbelievable turn of events as Prudhomme, with a 5.72 second elapsed time at 260 miles an hour, wins the Gator National. In replay, you can see just what happened. As they left the starting line almost simultaneously, it was a flash of fire. Something let go under the fiberglass body in the engine compartment, and Johnny West was forced to park it right next to the concrete guardrail. Don Prudhomme gets a well-deserved hug from his wife, Lynn. Gets a little more than a hug, actually. And Snake, a brand new race team winning the second time out. Did you ever even believe that was possible? Well, <laughs> you really? know, well, you know, not exactly. I figured we we're going to have to struggle a little bit more than we did to get in the winner's circle. We had a couple of good breaks, Steve. You know, Bernstein's car is obviously uh, still the killer car, and uh, we're going to take this car home back to California and run and test and work on it because uh, I'd like to win the championship again. That would be what the fifth time. Yeah, I think so. But you know, we got we were hooked up with Skull, and that's that was probably one of the best things ever had me and Pontiac. By the way, in case you don't count, I do. This is the fifth time you've won the Gator Nationals, but four and five had a pretty good separation. <laughs> yeah, well, it's been a long time since a national event, and I, I just couldn't be happier. I mean, I don't even know what to say. It's a, it's a dream come true. We love having you back. Thank you. At the age of 46, Don Bredome definitely on the comeback trail 